Hey there, my name is Sophie Whittemore. Um, I'm the filmmaker who created the music video Vote, and I was hoping that we could talk through some of the stylistic choices and how this music video came to be. It's starting now. So originally I wanted to start with the shot because I know personally I wanted to kind of like draw in the viewer like, oh, now we're going to be starting the song now. Um, so the original song was written by Alan Nichols and Steinatz and the prompt was to either record over the, the original music or to remaster it and to just kind of like have your own take on it. So what I ended up doing was taking a soundtrack off of the YouTube Music Audio Library, um, slowing it down to have more of an intimate beat because I did want it to kind of draw the viewer in again, kind of like, you can dance with this music video, you can be a part of it as well. And overlaid a vocal track over it using the original lyrics, um, again by Al Nicholson of Steinetz, and slowing that track down as well. So it feels almost kind of like a slow dance, I'd say. Um, and in the video itself, using footage from amazing like Pexel video artists, including Rodney Productions, Kelly Lacey, and other amazing artists credited at the end of the video. Uh, we, or I brought in some video and footage of couples dancing. So um, just kind of having fun, kind of smiling. And I know specifically in this time period as a young, a young voter, there's a lot of anxiety in the world today when it comes to being in the midst of a pandemic, when it comes to feeling like your voice isn't heard, that you as a person aren't heard, that people are fighting against systemic racism right now, that people are fighting against climate change essentially, and everything that impacts people on a daily basis leads people to feel like they aren't necessarily it's up to us. a part of the process anymore. And so I was hoping to create a music video that brought people in again with that kind of like intimate slower beat in a slow dance that made people feel like you are a part of this process and that even after voting, even after the election, positive change is not gonna stop. That your vote counts, you matter.